everyone, welcome back to Blueprint DIY, Angelina here, and today I have a very special video that I am collaborating with a company called Firmu, and if you've been watching my videos for a while, you know that this is not the first time that I am working with them. I received a pair of sunglasses for them back in April, um, but I got the opportunity to work with them again, and I am so thankful because I desperately needed some new glasses. I want to show you guys my glasses that I have been using for the last at least five years and they um, they were nice <laughs> a pair of coach glasses that um, I paid up the wazoo for um, that are like really loose and they're scratched and uh, is fading on the side so I desperately needed a new pair of glasses so I was so excited when they contacted me um, to pick out a pair of glasses now the problem is, is that I am used to the traditional method of picking out glasses where you go to the optometrist, you get your uh, prescription, your eye exam and everything, and then you try on glasses. And I'm not the type of person that goes and gets new glasses every year. I am the type of person that gets a pair of glasses and will wear them until they are like blown to bits, you know, they explode or something like that. So, um... I was very indecisive as far as choosing, or I, I, I got really anxious about, about choosing a pair of glasses online. So I wanted to come by and just give you guys some helpful tips on how, if you're an indecisive or anxious person like me, how do you choose glasses online? My first tip for you is to choose a website like for mood that one has inexpensive glasses because if they're inexpensive not like the traditional method which are all separate point but which are all mostly owned by one or two companies but um they're super expensive and you feel like you know i have to keep these for at least a year um but they you have other options these days with Fermu, all the frames are like 19 to 30 dollars in between 19 and 30 dollars you add another five or ten dollars for your lenses and you get a 30 dollar pair 30 35 dollar pair of glasses that you can wear for as long as i wore these glasses or you can switch them up and get multiple pairs. So I would, so even if you feel like you chose the wrong pair, they're inexpensive so you won't feel too bad because you know, you're not out of that much money. The second thing is I would recommend choosing a site like for move that has a try on option. And so basically what that is, is you can go on the site and you choose um, whatever frames that you like and you hit the try on button and it allows you to upload a picture of your face looking straight forward and it'll put the glasses on you so that you can get a sense of what the glasses are going to look on you, look like on you. And so I really enjoyed that process. I let my husband help me um, the first time around. And I'm going to get into that story about my indecisive journey of choosing glasses. But these are the glasses that I chose um, in the end. <laughs> and um, I really love them. They have like a little a bit of a red tint. And I really am enjoying these glasses. They are very much like the ones that I had before, the same shape. They're just a tiny bit bigger, which I enjoy. Um, but these are like my staple glasses, what I wear without makeup, just picking up the kids, dropping them off and stuff like that. But glasses have become, a, I mean, a fashion statement. So um, the first time I chose glasses, yes, I will say the first time because um, I chose two pair. But the first time when I was contacted, I chose a pair of glasses. I was trying to get out of my box and just be free, which is like completely like not me. But I was that's what I was trying to do. So I let my husband help me and he saw this pair of glasses. He was like, oh, that looks like a secretary or whatever. So I was like, okay, so I'll try those. And I'm gonna show you the pair of glasses. And just so you know, every pair comes with a cleaning cloth. Like I've been using it a ridiculous amount be just to keep the glasses clean because I really like to have my glasses clean now that they're not scratched. But, um, and each pair comes with a um, case and it always has a map 
um, of some place in the world, which I really like, and it has Fermu on it. So I really like that. And it also comes with a little keychain that you can carry around to fix your glasses, tighten them or loosen them if you see fit. So I really like that. But I wanted to show you guys the, gl the first glasses that I ordered. And here they are, and I'm going to put them on. And these are red. These glasses are red. And when they came in the mail, I looked and I was like, mm, I don't know if I like them. And so I showed my family. And the first thing the kids said is that, oh, mom, we, we like those. They look like Harry Potter. Really? Like, I want to look like Harry Potter? So I just automatically was like, no, I don't think I like these. But I was going to go forward with the video anyway because they were just super super um cool to you know include me and um to offer me the glasses so when the lady contacted me to ask me how i like the glasses i went ahead and told her like i didn't really like them so she offered to send me another pair so i'm so grateful to firm move for giving me the opportunity to get another pair and i got the these staple pair and i love them but um since I do have these, I've been trying to think of ways to, you know, use them. And so um, what I decided to do was just wear them for a few days and see how I could style them. So something like amazing happened. I realized that these are my attitude glasses. So yes, like I said, these are my attitude glasses. And I don't know, you know, I really got anxious and was thinking about the old process of choosing glasses and how I always kept them for a super long time. And it made me, you know, really anxious about this process. But this is a new, a completely new way of choosing glasses. And so there's no need for anxiety. So when you go on the website, definitely pay attention to the parameters. So if you have old glasses, you want to measure the width across as well as the length um, of the side piece right here that goes over your ear. And you want to see, you know, if you like the current fit of your glasses, you want to kind of match that. You don't have to because these are um, in a wide frame and these are in a medium. And so um, they, you can choose from narrow, medium, or wide based on, you know, the length across your face. Um, and just pick which is appropriate. But I love the fact that you can try the glasses on your picture and just get a sense of how they look on you and um, so definitely pay attention to the width and um, whether you want plastic frames or you want metal frames or different things like that and if you know your prescription you can even enter your own prescription in um, I love that as well as if you um, don't know your prescription definitely you can get your prescription from your um, eye doctor sometimes they make it seem like you have to order glasses through them but that is not true you can uh, as long as your prescription is current they have to give it to you so um, you can load it up in uh, from whose site your prescription or enter it yourself so I just really um, like this option for glasses wearers. I have been wearing glasses since I was in fourth grade. And, you know, I always felt like, you know, like it was a tragedy to have to wear glasses because you're the nerd. And the frames, you know, were so expensive that you couldn't really have options. So, um, and so much so, like it was a tragedy when my, they said that my daughter had to wear glasses. I would totally reject it. Like, no, she does not have to wear glasses. She has good eyes like her dad, but, um, um, it, it's not a tragedy um, now that I found that you know there are options so I am so excited to um, even go on and order more glasses so I keep you guys updated when I do get more pairs and um, a big thank you to Fermu and if you guys haven't subscribed definitely subscribe and I'll see you soon bye <laughs> Hey, hey, hey.